As I said, there are many different methods on the market, and uh, in this uh, application, I'm going to show you the uh, 3200 method, the thermal classic method. How we determine how much hair we're picking out is based on the density of the hair and how thick uh, the hair is in about quarter square inches. I'm going to start from the middle of your hair, just showing you the application process. Take about a quarter of square inches. I use a shield and attach this about quarter inches away from her scalp. All the bonds are pre-cut based on the client's desire, look, and again the density. So. Close the bonds and remove the shield. This is one strand. I'm going to do another one. You can add volume or length to the hair by this method, or you can add accent highlights or different color into the hair without damaging the hair by harsh colors or chemicals. As you see, this method is very simple and easy, but at the same time, it's very seamless. Next method I'm going to show you right next to this, these are the bonds on the thermal method. The next process is very similar, but it's done with a different machine, and that's with Ultrasonic 5000. As you see, the bonds are the same, the hair is the same, just the tip of the machine is cold. Neither one side has any heat. Place the hair underneath. This one, the bonds are flat. This is a very tedious and, um, I would say, methodical attachment. It takes a little bit more time. The bond goes immediately cold. So I'll fold them, tap, tap, and um, I'll smooth out the edges. And I am done with this as well. So the cold fusion versus the thermal method is mostly the bonding. These are more flat and against the head. The other ones are round like a, uh, I would say a rice grain. Her whole head pretty much done with this method. I have this section parted out to do the demo. So. After you drop the rest of the hair down, you blend the edges and pretty much you're done with the application process.